Hello everybody, thanks for joining us. My name is Andrew and I'm with Pure Resonance Audio. Today we're going to be answering the question of what does speaker watts mean? So we get this question a lot. In audio you hear that term watts. Um, you hear it in amplifier ratings and speaker ratings, and today we're going to specifically talk about watts when it comes to speakers. So speakers have different ratings. A couple of those is RMS ratings, which has to do with the continuous uh, wattage that a speaker can handle. Um, and then there's your peak power, which is also a rating in watts. So RMS is continuous, so it's what the speaker can handle continuously. So as you have that volume level up and you're playing music, um, it can handle a specific range um, that's safe to operate that speaker with. The peak power has to do with those songs when you're listening to, maybe you're listening to a rock song or something like that, and there's these moments in the song where the instruments get really excited and there's drums that are beaten, whatever the case may be. Um, you're not just listening to a song at the same wattage level, it's going like this. And so the continuous lets you know um, what it can handle at its very peak. To give you an example, a speaker might have a RMS of 100 watts and a peak power of 200 watts. So that means that you can safely run the speaker continuously at 100 watts or so. And then in those peak moments where it hits 200 watts, you're still in a safe range to operate that speaker. Here in front of us, we have a few speaker options. This just kind of gives you an idea um, of different speaker sizes. A lot of what we do is 70 volt audio systems. And in a 70 volt audio speaker, um, they have a transformer. Transformers have different wattage tap settings. So here we are talking about watts again. On a transformer, there's wattage tap settings. The higher you tap your speaker, the higher wattage is set on that speaker, the more output it's capable of. And it's kind of a safety mechanism in a system because it taps that speaker. It doesn't allow that speaker to have um, any more wattage than what you have it set to. So it's kind of capping it in a way. If you have any questions, let us know. This is a very brief overview um, of what Watts has to do with with speakers. But if you have any questions, you can always contact us and we'll be happy to help. In the meantime, thanks for joining us and we'll see you guys in the next video.